Hello all and today we will discuss how to edit security group settings uh, for an EC2 instance. In this video today we will see how we can add HTTP and HTTPS to an EC2 instance. So this is my AWS account and as you see um, I have one EC2 instance running at this time. This is an Windows. Uh, this is in Windows EC2 instance. So it's Windows Server 2016, uh, and it has a security group that I had created by launching this instance called as Windows SG associated to it. So let's click on Windows SG. Now, by default, uh, when you when you create a security group for uh, a Windows Server, it will give you an port uh, port 3389 um, for RDP enabled as an inbound port, as you see over here. Uh, as far as the outbound traffic is concerned, all traffic, uh, all protocol, all port range is all enabled. But for inbound, only RDP is. Uh, available to you by default and this is just in case you need to RDP into your server so let's say now to this uh, uh, to this very specific uh, security group if we want to enable HTTP and HTTPS then how do we go about doing that so let's click on edit uh, add a rule HTTP and again, uh, if we have a custom range from where we would want um, this particular uh, machine to be HTTP from, then we should add the custom range. Generally, it would be recommended that for RDP, uh, you do not leave it open uh, to the whole wide world, just like how it is right now. It would be good to have your own IP. For example, I can say my IP and my IP address would be uh, something from where I could RDP. To this box but for HTTP uh, what we are going to do is we are just going to keep it open at this time now the next rule that we will be adding is uh, let's say HTTPS uh, so as you see port is 443 and again it is open so anybody from the internet can uh, HTTP and HTTP to the HTTPS to this particular machine on port 80 and 443 uh, respectively so let's save these settings and then you will see that uh, these settings were added so HTTP and both HTTPS both of these product these two protocols have been added and you have successfully uh, modified your security group so, uh, thank you uh, I hope you enjoyed this lecture and uh, if you have any suggestions or if you would like me to cover any other topics uh, do let me know feel free to leave comments at the bottom and I will most certainly post a video on that topic thank you